What a great day for Alabama. A terrific day for Alabama, one of two in the nation. And I dare anybody say that in Alabama, we can't do things right. And I'm very proud of that. And it's important that you're here so that you know what we're doing in this day and age when we have so much negativity about what our young people are capable of doing. It's great to see programs like this and let them continue to fulfill their potential. And that's really, in a nutshell, what we do here. Over this week, I have found that there is so much that I, have, that I did not know about this city. For our young people, uh, they don't know that it's there. They, they don't pay attention when they drive in their cars with their families, buy those industries. But so we put them up in the guts of it. And it really showed us about job opportunities that are actually presented to us in Mobile that I didn't even really know about. And they have good pay that I also, I learned that they had good pay and that you also didn't need a college degree. So it could have been a good plan, like plan B or maybe even a plan A, depending on how much I would have enjoyed it. Now that we have some funding sources uh, as we pursue this, we've decided to, to focus on in the future the three main areas of manufacturing in our area. Maritime, with our shipbuilding industry. Aviation, which is our focus from last year. And next year we hope to focus on advanced manufacturing, which includes things like steel making, uh, chemical uh, manufacturing, uh, how we generate power to for our region. Those are all very important industries, and Mobile, Alabama has those things in, in, in our region. And so I'm, I'm really optimistic that these 100 plus students, 160 students a year that we see will make a difference as we go through, uh, through the next decade. I want to boost my confidence in myself. So if I put myself outside of my comfort zone, which in here they do that, I'll better myself. One thing about Junior ROTC that I wanted to make a difference with is that we are educators first and foremost, and that our program must support the mission of our superintendent from this peak and now soon to be Mr. Threadgill, that we contribute to the education mission of our district. And I am confident that this program does that. What I would have been doing was, would probably be just sitting at my house doing nothing at all. Instead, I've come here to learn, to get more knowledge on what I can do with my life after high school. I've got one year left, so I, uh, it's time I need to really take a stop and take a minute and realize what I need to do. And STEM camp has helped me realize what I want to do. It's helped me realize what I need to do to get myself ready for after high school. It's, it, it makes you stop and think. They've been exposed to all of these great careers in Mobile, and hopefully they know that if I take the right path and focus on these particular academic subjects, I can have a very successful and very, very happy life. That's what I want for our students here.